Hi friends! Today for our food review video we are going to go over these nacho cheese dips. First we have here, this is the Doritos spicy nacho flavored and it smells definitely spicy and cheesy and I actually would have to cook each of these for about 25 to 30 seconds so that way they were warm and prepared but this one was by far the easiest one to open because the lid just snaps on and off and there was a, a little foil cover to remove this one is the oh and this is what the Doritos one looks like you can see the I don't know if they're spices or vegetable chunks or whatever's in that then we have here great value a cheddar cheese dip oh so this one might not be as spicy because I think this one's just cheddar which I guess this one's pretty smooth probably because there aren't any veggies or spiciness or whatever to it yeah, and it smells kind of mild too. It kind of smells just like mac and cheese. This one is the Tostitos natural cheese dip medium. So let's show you what that one looks like. Oh, I forgot to show you the other one. They're all very similar inside. This one is the Tostitos medium. It has kind of a darker color than the cheddar cheese one. I'm not seeing a whole lot of chunks of vegetables, but I do, I think, see some spices and stuff. So anyway, we will give these three a try and see which one I like best. Um, this one was definitely the harder jar to open. So, I mean, but we're not gonna, we're judging by taste, not by how difficult or easy it was to open the jar. Okay, so this one is the, this one is the Doritos Spicy Nachos. Mmm. Nice. I do taste the cheese and the spicy. Mmm. Might be a little too spicy. I probably actually need some water. So if you do not like spicy, maybe don't get the maybe don't get the Doritos one because that one really is is super spicy um, although it does have like I said the it looks like the vegetables and other things in it so probably will have a little more fiber than this next one this next one is the cheddar cheese dip I was I thought I had gotten all nachos but this one's actually more of a cheddar cheese dip this one like I said before it smells like like mac and cheese mm. Yeah, really not that spicy. So, if you want something a little more bland that's not so spicy, then go for this um, cheddar cheese dip instead. It's not very hot at all. It's pretty, pretty mild. In fact, I would probably say this one even has probably less salt than the others. It's because it's not that salty either. Um, let's try this Tostitos nacho cheese dip next this one's a medium so hopefully it's not as hot as the doritos brand but we will find out mm. definitely some spice there not entirely sure which ones but this one is much tastier than than the cheddar cheese dip this one's got some of the Spices that you'd expect from the nacho, not nacho flavoring, but it doesn't have any of the vegetables or whole chilies or whatever it is that they put in the Dorito mix. And no, no noticeable aftertaste on any of them either. So let's see, how would I rank these? I actually find this one a little too spicy. But I actually like the nacho cheese flavorings. This one's a little bland for me. So I would probably have to put the great value here at the end because not exactly very flavorful for me. 
The Doritos is flavorful, but it's a little spicy, as I mentioned before. I probably would need to have this one with water. I mean, not water, milk, um, to help kind of help with the spiciness here. So I think my favorite is probably the Tostitos Nacho Cheese Dip Medium because it is definitely uh, spicy, but not too spicy for me anyway. I'm sure if someone else were reviewing this and they liked spicy, they would probably choose Doritos. And maybe the kids, if they don't like spicy, might choose the, the cheddar cheese dip instead. Anyway, that's my review for the nacho cheese dip. Let me know in the comments below which one your favorite cheese dip is. Please like and subscribe. See ya!